China took a major step in showcasing its growing air power with the first-ever static display of its advanced J-20 stealth fighter, coinciding with the announcement that the fleet has now reached an impressive 300 aircraft in service. The landmark moment unfolded at a high-profile air show, where for the first time spectators were able to see the mighty dragon not just soaring in the skies in tightly choreographed flight demonstrations, but also parked on the ground for close-up viewing. This shift from strictly aerial performances to a static exhibition was interpreted by analysts as a strong signal of Beijing's confidence in the maturity, reliability, and operational readiness of its most advanced fighter jet. The J-20, developed by Chengdu Aerospace Corporation, represents the centerpiece of the People's Liberation Army Air Force's modernization drive, embodying the transition of Chinese military aviation from legacy fourth-generation platforms into the era of stealth and network-centric warfare. Designed with radar-evading features, advanced sensors, data link capabilities and long-range strike potential, the aircraft has often been compared to American fifth-generation fighters such as the F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II. Its distinctive Canard Delta configuration, coupled with stealth coatings and advanced radar systems, positions it as a formidable asset in China's pursuit of regional and global air superiority. The decision to allow the public and foreign observers to examine it up close suggested a newfound willingness by Beijing to display not only its technological prowess but also its confidence that the J-20 has moved beyond developmental uncertainty into reliable mass production. The milestone of the 300th jet entering service underscores the scale of China's military industrial capacity and reflects the speed at which the J-20 fleet has expanded since its introduction into frontline operations in 2017. In less than a decade, the program has grown into the world's second-largest fifth-generation fighter force, trailing only the United States F-35 program. This rapid buildup highlights China's strategic intent to shift the balance of aerial power in the Asia-Pacific region. With the J-20 increasingly deployed to air bases along China's eastern seaboard and near-contested areas such as the Taiwan Strait and the South China Sea, the aircraft plays a central role in deterrence and in the projection of military power. Experts have emphasized that the J-20's ability to carry long-range air-to-air missiles, combined with its stealth features, makes it a critical component in China's efforts to challenge U.S. air dominance in the Western Pacific. The static display also offered insights into design improvements and potential upgrades. Close inspection revealed subtle refinements in airframe shaping and finish, which suggest continued enhancements in radar cross-section reduction and aerodynamic performance. Observers also noted that the J-20 is increasingly being fielded with China's domestically developed WS-15 engines, which promise greater thrust, improved fuel efficiency, and enhanced supercruise capabilities. The integration of indigenous engines is viewed as a decisive step in eliminating reliance on foreign components, marking China's progress toward self-sufficiency in advanced aerospace technologies. For China's leadership, the unveiling carried deep symbolic significance. By pairing the static display with the announcement of the 300th aircraft, Beijing projected a message of technological confidence, industrial strength and military ambition to both domestic audiences and international rivals. The J-20 has become not only a weapon of war but also a tool of strategic signaling, demonstrating that China is determined to join and remain among the elite powers capable of sustaining mass production of fifth-generation stealth fighters. Military analysts suggest that the display was designed to reassure domestic audiences of China's defense preparedness while simultaneously sending a cautionary signal to foreign militaries monitoring the balance of power in the Indo-Pacific. In the long term, the continued growth of the J-20 fleet will likely reshape regional air power dynamics. With more aircraft entering service each year, China is expected to deploy the Mighty Dragon in greater numbers to key air bases, integrated into joint operations with other modern platforms like the Y-20 Transport and KJ-500 Early Warning Aircraft, and refine its role in China's evolving doctrine of integrated air and space operations. The static display therefore was more than a ceremonial milestone, it was a declaration of China's intent to field not just advanced aircraft, but an entire ecosystem of modernized air power. By combining a rare public unveiling with the symbolic 300th aircraft milestone, China underscored the J-20 status as the backbone of its future air force and as a central pillar of its long-term strategy to achieve technological parity, or even superiority, with Western rivals. The Mighty Dragon's first static display will be remembered as a turning point, marking China's evolution from an aspiring stealth power to a nation with a mass-produced, combat-ready fifth-generation fighter force capable of shaping the strategic balance of the 21st century.